Hello everyone, now let's see how we can take our target or a website offline. So in order to take our target or a website into our system, we will use this software STTrack. So STTrack is a website copier which is used to copy the entire content of the website including JavaScript pages, CSS and HTML pages. So as a penetration tester, sometime we faced a conditions where we have to test the website but not on a production server. So as a penetration tester, we will use this tool in order to copy our target or a website into our local system. So once we copy the website, we can host that files into our local host server and we will test that website. Now let's see that how we can use STTrack in our Kali Linux. Now let's see that how we can use STTrack. So as I told you earlier that STTrack is available for Linux as well as Windows. So STTrack is by default or a pre-built installed in Kali Linux so we have to start it. So here you can see that right now I am inside my Kali Linux instance. So in order to start STTrack we have to open the terminal. So just click over here and you can see the terminal. Now just simply type here STTrack and hit enter. So once we hit enter, here you can see that right now we are inside the STTrack website copier. So the first of all, it asks for the project name. So let, let us give the project name called as demo. Okay, now it asks for the directory in which it will store the website. So if you want to give a particular directory in which you want to save the copied website, then you can, otherwise you can just leave empty and hit enter. So if you just leave this empty, then by default it will save all the website files in this directory slash root slash websites. Now here we have to add the URL. So let me add a URL here. and let's hit enter okay so now it give us the action list so the first one is mirror website then the second one is mirror website with wizard then if you want to just fetch out all the urls and if you just want to fetch out the test links but here we are interested in mirroring the website so i'll select the first one and let's hit enter so if you want to give a proxy URL then you can otherwise leave it empty leave it also empty hit enter hit enter again okay so now ready to launch the mirror now if you are ready to launch the website copier then just write down here why and hit enter so you can just see here that you are running this program as a root okay thanks for using STTrack so now STTrack has copied this website modern Indian babies names.com now let's go to that directory slash root slash website to check whether our website has been copied or not so let me just go there first of all let's see that where we are so we are inside root let's do ls so here is that website directory hit enter do ls so here is the project name demo so let's go to demo directory hit enter again ls so here you can see a few details like cache log, log.txt and here is one directory called as modernindianbabiesname.com which was our target. So let's go there, hit enter and here you can see that it, it has fetched and copied its index page. So let's open this page in Firefox and let's see how it looks like. okay so here you can see that it has copied this page along with the JavaScript and CSS files so here you can see and you can also check the path so this was all about STTrack so thanks for watching this video